Auto parts supplier Takata has declared bankruptcy, but that was not a huge surprise after it caused the biggest recall in U.S. auto history. Roughly 120 million of Takata's airbags have been deemed potentially unsafe worldwide. More than half of those are in the United States. In fact, the U.S. recall is bigger than the next five largest U.S. recalls combined. It affects nearly one in every five cars in the United States. So if you own a car made in the last 15 years, there's a pretty good chance your car has a bad airbag. Takata supplied airbags to major manufacturers like Honda, and Toyota, and Ford, and all these guys. Takata and automakers haven't decided how to split the cost of years of recalls yet. So what went wrong? It isn't just that the bags aren't inflating. When a car with one of these faulty bags gets into an accident, the airbag can explode. They use a chemical called ammonium nitrate as a propellant, but over time it begins to destabilize. The casing that's holding the ammonium nitrate breaks apart, and it does so so violently that it ends up sending metal shards flying into drivers and passengers. Eleven people in the U.S. alone have died from Takata airbag shrapnel, almost all of them in the southern part of the country. It turns out long exposure to heat and humidity are what's causing the ammonium nitrate to destabilize. Takata admitted to hiding the danger posed by its exploding airbags in a plea deal with U.S. prosecutors in February, in which it agreed to pay regulators, consumers, and car makers $1 billion in penalties. You can go to this website to see if your car is on the recall list using the car's 17-digit VIN number, but if it is, be prepared to wait. It could be a while before you can get your car fixed. Since airbags on each make and model of car are unique, replacing 64 million of them requires a lot of parts that are in very high demand. Completing all of the recalls may take well into 2020. The huge cost of the airbag crisis finally brought Takata down. In June 2017, the company filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy, listing more than $10 billion in liabilities. Most of Takata's assets will be acquired for around $1.6 billion by a Chinese-owned company, Key Safety Systems. Money from that sale is expected to help cover ongoing costs related to the airbag recall. Meanwhile, as drivers wait for their airbags to be fixed, they're left with cars that are potentially dangerous to drive, all because of a device that was put there to keep them safe.